they marched from far and wide in the cold, wintry conditions. More than 150 Reserve Force soldiers put their strength and stamina to the test. The competition took place in the hills behind Dunedin, and it was from Dunedin that a winner emerged. Lance Corporal Chris King from the Bravo Company, and his strategy for the race was to take it stage by stage. Uh, just making it to that first mark, I think, was a highlight. Low light was going back up that goat track. King finished in a record time of just over three hours, 18 minutes ahead of his nearest rival from Wellington. It was a sweet victory for the local Lance Corporal, who finished in second place last year. But he's still not a fan of the course. The course was horrendous, but the individuals, I suppose, it wasn't that bad comparably with the teams because we pretty much just muddied it up for everyone else going through, so we probably had the easiest run. Most competitors conquered the 26 kilometre course in teams, and 33 hardy souls did it alone. But the conditions were the same for all. Muddy, to say the least. Um, yeah, it was pretty foggy the whole way, really. The conditions really didn't change. They're sort of drizzly. Not too cold up there, though. No real winds. So. The day started early, with competitors gearing up at dawn. And it was hours before they were finished, ready for a hot shower and some grub. But plenty of them will be back to tough it out next year. Rosie Mannins, 39, Dunedin News.